Oh, oh. Hi everyone. <laughs> Welcome back. Today we're going to teach freeze. Hey, you say hello. Say hello to the camera. <laughs> ah, you're such a good boy. Off you go. <laughs> Hi. All right. So we're going to be teaching our dogs freeze. You're probably asking, what the hell is that? Okay, it's actually very simple. All right. So here we go. Did you see that? Come. Freeze! Freeze! Good. Come. You are the best boy. <laughs> okay, come here. Practice makes perfect. Nice. Sit. Nicely. Good. So freeze is actually the emergency stop. All right. As an example, let's say my dog gets out of the gate runs across the road, I call him back, but a car is coming. I cannot tell him the freeze word, that's a command that he's learned. He will stop. The car can pass. I can continue the recall. My dog comes to me. He's safe, and he did not get hit by a car. All right, so it's actually the emergency stop, and I want to teach it to you guys. So we're just going to run through it quickly. I hope you understand now what freeze actually is. Many people will just tell their dog down and the dog will lie down. Isla, my bull terrier, she did that. She had the best down ever. I said down to her, the dog would just drop into her down. So that worked really, really well for her. That's not going to work for Lycan. That's why I taught him freeze. He's really very good at it. So let's go through this whole story. Freeze! Wait. Okay. Okay, so if you're in the felt and you're walking along and you're coming to a T-junction like in that video, um, I would want to stop my dog a few meters before the actual T-junction so that I can catch up to the dog while the dog is in freeze mode. I can now check left and right to see if there's anything I should worry about, especially if there's a wall and you can't see immediately what's up the wall. I can just basically now freeze the dog, go check, safe, right, we can continue with our walk. Freeze. Freeze, you clever boy. Okay, <laughs> Good boy. So on the walk itself, let's say I'm in the felt somewhere or in a forest or whatever, and all of a sudden I see someone with a dog. Maybe that dog is on leash. It looks really, ah, and I really don't want my boy going there for whatever reason. I can just call out freeze. He will stop. I can basically from them leash him and we can continue our walk through the felt and I can release him again when it's safe. So that's another area of life. You can apply the word freeze. Freeze. Good boy. So we're done with our walk and we're coming out of the felt, we're approaching the road. Chances are your dog will be ahead of you like mine always is. And before he gets to the road and decides to walk home all by himself, which he would probably be able to do, he's very capable. I would call out freeze, he does that, I catch up to him, I can leash him now and we can continue together and walk home safely. So it all boils down to a safety exercise that you really, really want to teach your dog. And I am going to do that. This video was to show you what it actually is. And look out for a future video because that one is going to teach you how 
to teach freeze to your dog, whether they are next to you, in front of you, or you are calling them over a road and you need to stop them before they get hit by a car because a car just appeared out of the blue. So look out for that one and I will see you in future videos. Thanks for watching. Bye from myself. Bye from my boy Nikon who has now disappeared. And we'll see you soon. Take care.